Hey guys, welcome to Urban Angler TV. This week we're in the City of Angels, and I get asked a question all the time. Mark, I'll see you later, babe. Uh, I get asked, Mark, can you eat the fish that you actually catch? Well, we've got a group called Friends of the LA River, and they've offered to test a carp that I catch out of here to see if it's edible. If it's edible, I'll eat it. Carmelo here from the Friends of the LA River. Fish is here every day, don't you? How you doing, man? Nice to see you again. So uh, tell me about Friends of the LA River. What is it about? Well, it started by Lewis McAdams and, um, about 20 years ago, and it was mainly about getting people down into the river to enjoy the LA River as it should be. And uh, it's an advocacy group, and it's about educating people about what's, you know, that we do have a river in Los Angeles. And it is and fishable, obviously. Well, now, yeah, <laughs> the, the quote is a uh, swimmable, fishable, bikeable river. Right. Something like that. And um, so I'm part of their, like, sort of, uh, they're, they're fishing core. They're, yo, you're right. Okay. Yeah, but it's a great group. I mean, they, they support the river 100%. How do we, how do we get? In, how do people get in contact with them? They got a website. Yeah, uh, folar.org. Folar.org. Yeah. All right, cool. So how you been? How, you know, you've been catching this morning. Yeah, yeah. Um, I caught a 15 and a half pounder uh, this morning. This is the biggest one I've caught so far. Is there any catfish? There are catfish in here. I've seen catfish in here. I've never caught a catfish, and you see some sunfish every once in All a right. while. All right, okay. Um, but the fish that uh, guys are catching are the carp. How good a fight on the fly pole do they give you? Oh, it's awesome. Yeah, really runs your heart? Yeah. You ever they, been broken off? Um, yeah, actually, I just broke my rod uh, yesterday. <laughs> All right, well, I'm gonna go to a different method. I'm gonna go old school with the can that my dad used to taught me, you know, uh -huh. wind yeah, the can yeah, around. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna hand line it out there with the tortillas, which you recommend. Yeah, yeah, that's the, I mean, if you're gonna bait fish, that's the way to do it down here. I mean, uh, you know, the carp are also known as a Tijuana trout. So, uh, <laughs> corn tortilla is like, is, is it's golden, huh? It's golden, man. Right in this section, just cast it right out here, just free line it, you'll, you'll be good. Thanks, man. And when we were kids, we didn't have money for poles, so this is what we use. Beer can, weight, hook, got my tortillas. Let's go see what happens this time. You, you caught a 15 pounder? Yeah, I caught a 15 pounder. Heck, that's gonna tear this can right out of my oh, hand. Man. What pound test is this? <laughs> it's eight. See, see how, like, when you don't heat it up, how it just flakes off? Yeah. See that? No, it's bueno. Yeah. When the carp are on the bite, they'll, they'll take this tortilla and gobble it up all day but it's just a matter of they're on the bite or not i mean they're the rodney dangerfield of fish but they feel like you know they're fun to catch i gotta heat these tortillas up so <laughs> we made a little campfire out here on the la river and we're gonna we're gonna toast them up a little bit i reckon you don't want to burn them you just want to get them nice and warm and then they'll stick on that hook better oh yeah guys that's that's the way to do it. You gotta heat. You gotta heat the tortilla up. All right, let's get this back out there. This ain't working. Come on, munch it down, pal. There he goes. Whoa. <laughs> now, that, now that's a fight, man. <laughs> All right, this, hey folks, this, <laughs> this might be a while because I got real light line on this pole. Yeah, just let him run. Yeah, just let him run, huh? Carmelo tells me to let him run. I listen to the expert. I'm latched onto a pretty big sized carp right now with real light line. You can hear him pulling my drag. This might be an all day sucker right here. <laughs> My arm's starting to hurt even. I can't get nothing on him. <laughs> That's unbelievable. I mean, nobody would believe this, you know? You were only in there five, 10 oh, minutes. Yeah, yeah, it hit real fast. I mean, I got two really good bumps and then yeah. I, I missed them. When we take it over to the lab and test it, if this thing's edible, I can use the same tortillas to make tacos <laughs> with it. <laughs> I mean, how many how many carp do you think are in this little section right here? Section right here. Full of them, huh? Hundreds. Hundreds, huh? Yeah, I mean, I try to advocate, you know, catch and release, so there's going to be plenty of sure. fish to catch. But there are but, some people that fish in here for sustenance. 
Oh, man. How about that? That's a good size one. <laughs> that is an enormous car <laughs> out of the LA River. <laughs> oh, well, this is going to be our test subject. I'm sorry, I've got to take one, but just the people want to know. People want to know, I guess. People want to know. What you say? That's about what? Eight pounds? That's about, I say about 14. No. <laughs> Come on, fishermen, <laughs> fishermen all lie. Yeah, that's about an eight, nine pound fish. Wow. Thing weighs a ton. All right, guys, I want to thank my guy Carmelo of Friends of the LA River. I know this ain't politically correct to take one of these carp out of here, but we just, we need to know. Uh, we're gonna head off, hop the train, go over to the lab in Torrance, see what they say. See you in a bit. Thanks a lot, man. All right, man. Appreciate Take all care. the tips. Later. That guy's nuts. LA River, man. Yeah. Oh, cool, man. Thanks, bro. Hey, a friendly metro station. Hook me up with some, with the bags. So I don't have to carry them around anymore. Oh, thank you, man. Man, <laughs> you don't want to touch it either. I don't blame you. Thanks, bro. Uh, yeah, unfortunately. Hey, we got to pick. No, I remember it's kind of polluted, you yeah. know. <laughs> About time to go to a taco truck, I think. Kind of getting hungry. So get this, the lab wouldn't even test my fish. So I'm coming to the truck, I'm gonna test it myself. Uh, hey man, you cook this for me? Yeah, yeah. Cool, we'll get, we'll, we'll find out if it's safe or not ourselves. Yeah, you're gonna eat this to kill the flavor. Of kill the flavor of that? Oh, thanks man, I appreciate it. You gave me a mint. Oh, it's a lot of stuff in the, inside the, <laughs> the LA River. Sweet. Tires. A lot of trash, a lot of bodies, maybe. <laughs> oh, it's coming out. All right, well, it's ready. Thanks, boss, I think. Well, <laughs> I got lemon, got this white sauce, got onions. I got an LA River carp. I got a lemon, thank God. <laughs> For you, Dad, he's, he's crazy. Yeah, I'm just gonna put some more hot sauce on. <laughs> All right, squeeze the lemon. Okay. <laughs> bon appetit, right? <laughs> Want the truth or you want me to lie to you? Not the truth. It's not very good. Their sauce is great. The fish is real, real muddy tasting. Like tastes like I'm eating dirt. Yeah, dirt. What'd you think about it? Uh-uh. No, uh, no. That's our worst review yet. Uh, <laughs> no, no, but you're going to make our own hey, how, about, how about you get, make me one of your real ones and I can eat that instead of the carp Okay, so that's uh, with crab or, or mixed? Let's go mixed one, man. Thanks a lot. Hey guys, well, I can honestly say it tastes straight up like mud, so I'm not going to be doing that again. I want to thank uh, the friends of the LA River for helping us out down there. I want to thank Eagle Claw. I want to thank Panther Vision. I want to thank the guys here in the truck. It's the Blue Sea. El Mar Azul, Marisco Estilo DF. And it's on, it's on Figueroa. It's right, right by the LA River. Come get the real deal from them and uh, avoid the carp. We'll see you next week on Urban Anchor TV. Thanks a lot, everybody. Well, little buddy, that's show business.